Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I just wanted to do a quick video about what was in my clinical bag. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. So before we get started by clinical bag, I just mean my clinical bag for lab. Sorry, I like creeping on my neighbors. <laughs> Um, okay, so yeah, this is my clinical bag. This is the bag that uh, was given to me by my program. It's um, from this Meredith's Uniform Company. And there's a piece of paper here, and I just put my full name back there. There's also this tag that says Meredith's Uniforms, and it's actually in Vidalia, Georgia. When I open my bag, I have a blood pressure. Phenomenometer? I don't even know. We just say blood pressure cuff. So, this is a cuff. Ooh. It's nicely um, wrapped together. It looks like this is a bag for it. Oh, that's nice. So, I have a little bag. Um, oh, also, keep the watch. Don't ask me why I spent $40 on a watch, but I needed one. And Walmart didn't have any of them. Like literally their whole section was empty. And I was like, what kind of Walmart is this? Anyway, so I begin to open it. That sound is so satisfying. <laughs> it just tickles my ears. Okay. Then I open, and it has this box. <gasps> the little pumper, what is this called? I don't know. I don't know the actual terminology, y'all, but here's an instruction manual. Oh, my food. Sarah, I just came back from school, and I'm hungry. So this is what I'm eating for dinner. Um, this is just some Nigerian stew with chicken. The little dots you see is actually um, black quinoa. I saw that at the farmer's market and I was just like, ooh, let me get that. Abre la boca. Abre la boca. Abre la boca, por favor. ¿Quieres comida? Abre la boca. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. Girls gotta eat. So where were we? Ah! All right, so I have a little pressure pump thingy. Oh, yay. Nice, so we have the hook and the clip here. And here is the cuff. I'm gonna put this and not this one. Okay, so like I said in the beginning of this video, this isn't my actual clinical bag. I'm so happy to get our bag today. Um, our uniform was basically scrub pants and a salad t-shirt. I don't wear bras, TMI, sorry. <laughs> I don't wear bras. And so it's like I have to wear a tank top under my shirt and then sometimes it's like, ah, so I mostly wore my lab coat today because Oh no, I just don't like bras. Yo, this is so cool. I can't wait to actually use this. I'm gonna take my own um, blood pressure. Oh, so by the way, so in this bag, we went over everything that was in it in class today. Um, and we basically have two of each. So we have basically one set to use during the semester. And then we have the other set that's going to be used at the end of our program semester so we're just supposed to have this for basically two years <laughs> so tracheostomy clean and clear tray what is this for i don't know yet i don't know yet so tracheostomy i'm gonna think guess it's gonna have to do something with the trachea, that's what I know. So we have two of these. 
and I'm obviously not gonna open it. <clears throat> but I will show this. Like I mean, I don't, I don't know. Like I don't know what this is because this is sterile, and I know like in our labs you're gonna have to have like a sterile field and all that stuff. I watched those videos from class. All right, so it's number two. The gauze. So we got some gauze. What's up, guys? <laughs> What's up, guys? I'm about to do my intro. <laughs> hey, what's up, guys? And welcome back to my channel. <laughs> okay, this is so funny to me. Hey, guys. What's up, guys? So I got two packs of gauze sponges. Pretty uh, simple there. All right, next I have a section catheter kit. Cannot wait to do stuff with this. I've always heard catheter in this. Oh, we're gonna put a catheter in this. I've heard like heart catheters. I've heard, you know, like all, like, all these different catheter thingies. And I'm just kind of like, interesting. A tube is going to be inserted somewhere. All I'm thinking is pain, but it's pretty, it's probably not as crazy as I, as I you know think it is because I honestly know nothing about like terminology right so I'm learning all those things in school you know self-study and everything so someone's like oh catheter I'm sorry huh it's an easy google search pretty much so yeah next I have a dressing change tray so there's um face mask gloves Tape measure, alcohol, swap sticks. Just, just a bunch of stuff. Just read it. Next, I have this closed circuit Folly catheter tray. So another catheter related substance. So we have a suction catheter kit and a closed circuit Folly catheter tray. What is this? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what a Folly is, but I know that I'm gonna know what a Folly is. So there's a Folly catheter, drainage bag, bed sheet clamp, syringe, waterproof jig. There's a bunch of things in here, okay? I have two of these. You know, one for when it's being used and then one for the end of the semester. Yay! Thumbnail. <laughs> I'm probably gonna Google some photo for my thumbnail. So this, this wasn't actually, oh! This wasn't actually in the bag before. We were actually given this and a pen light separately. Ooh, last important thing, guys. This. <laughs> Trick dude. But anyways, so that's that. And then I also have my stethoscope. Ah! I'm so excited to have this. All right, guys, so I'm gonna be doing an unboxing for you guys right now, live on camera. Oh my gosh, unboxing video, hashtag reviews. <laughs> And I'm just kidding, I already opened it. So, I already opened my stethoscope thingamajig. Uh, yeah, so all this stuff in here is this manual and some extra um, air plugs and this little ring for, I believe, the diaphragm or maybe for the doll. Is that big for the diaphragm? I don't know. I also have this case. I don't know if I showed this during my haul my supply haul, but I have this at the time. I just didn't have a stethoscope. Oh, pro happy, this is really cute. Pink isn't really my favorite color anymore, but I did want to get something a little, you know, girly or whatever, so that's why I bought the color pink. So this is how it looks when it's opened. And this is very soft. I love texture, so this feels really good and soft. And then you can flip it over and it has this like really cool textured item here. I don't know what that's for. But as you can see, here is my stethoscope. Ooh, la 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 la. Huh? the basics right you have a watch and you have your stethoscope okay <laughs> so this is really nice i um i got the black one i ordered a blue one originally off amazon but i thought it was a fake because i couldn't hear anything my silly self you know why i probably didn't hear anything 
because I didn't have the space in the right direction. So as you all know, the stethoscope is supposed to be outwards like that, like outwards. And then you put it over in your ears like this. Ooh, it just tickles your ears. So if you want to rotate to the bell side, you just kind of like switch it, switch. So basically wherever you see this, dot tells you what it's on yeah so the dot tells you there's like a little indentation here it tells you what what side it's on I have this really pretty chrome color to it Ugh. so I'm just trying to have it against this color so you see it's like a rainbow color come on focus camera there we go, we're focusing. All right, so it's super cute. This is mine. Ba -boom, ba -boom, ba -boom. Actually, it's supposed to be right here. Oh, sorry guys. It's supposed to be right here. Ba -boom. But um, yeah, so this is my stethoscope. I know, I, like, I don't know, like this is just kind of like a solidifier for me. Like, I'm not just gonna drop over $100 for something I'm not gonna use, right? So this is gonna be last, so this will be lasting me through my program. Um, and yeah, I'm just so happy to have one. I really wanted to buy one while I was in my prereqs, just to kind of like have the vision of, you know, passing my class and getting accepted to the program. But I also was just kind of, kind of like, I was gonna just get a, a really cheap one at the bookstore, it was like $15, but I was like, you know what, I don't want my first stethoscope to be on a basis of hope and chance. I want it to be like an actual thing. So once I got accepted to the program, I had to do my little supplies. And um, yeah, so I have my cute little stethoscope. And I know not everyone has lemon, but it is what it is. I got lemon because that's what people were talking about in YouTube Galaxy. So as an inhabitant of that world, I'm going to listen to what people recommended. And then here's the back part of it. So soft, literally just so soft. I like feeling things. I just like textures. I do want to get a scrub top because that's what's required for labs in class. So we have to wear black scrub pants, we have to wear a solid colored shirt, and I think it would be better to have like an actual scrub top versus like a regular t-shirt where the girls are peeking through. They're like. But yeah, so that's pretty much it for this video. I hope y'all enjoyed. I know it was kind of probably all over the place, but um yeah so obviously for when i actually have my clinicals i'm probably just gonna use this bag because i don't think there's much we're gonna be doing anyways it's not like i'm gonna need like it's not like i'm gonna be administering drugs and all these different things right so i'm just gonna save my coins and just use what i was given i pretty much paid for this already with um tuition and fees uh, i really just want to thank you guys so much for watching my videos i'm so blown away by all of these that i've gotten from my other video i mean i know it's not a lot it's not even to a thousand yet but just because it's past 100 i'm just kind of like ah! oh my gosh and like my analytics are just going it's just going through the roof so i really just want to thank you guys so much for watching my videos also special shout out to all my um nursing school classmates <laughs> i love it so thank you guys so much for your support for following my youtube i really appreciate it and i just love you guys already we're gonna be really close throughout these next two years so um obviously you know who you are because i've talked to you and you're watching my video so i just want to thank you guys so much and for those who have no clue who I am or just happened upon this video, hello, I'm so glad that you're here. Please consider subscribing to my video and for everyone watching this, please like my video. And I just wanna thank you guys again times a million. And I'll see you guys in the next video, bye.